Hello, in this tutorial I want to show a technique to stamp out a uh, texture uh, to the surface of a text. Uh, I have this uh, texture, a rusty metal texture, and I want that the text just show this texture surface. So I make a new composition and create a new text. And I put the texture inside. For me it's very big so I have to size it. And now the usual way is to go to the moving mask and uh, set it to alpha mati the, uh, to the texture. <laughs> so it's stamped out. But there's uh, another way <coughs> where we also use this feature but um, I like this more because you have the opponent uh, op uh, opportunity to uh, um, to change a lot of things afterwards. So I go to the layer menu and I uh, choose this one. I don't know how it's called in English because I have a German version, and automatically uh, it converts the text uh, the uh, to uh, masks. And that's because I choose alpha channel and the text have an alpha channel and you also can uh, choose the luminance or uh, red channel. Uh, that Sometimes it's uh, very useful when you have um, footage and um, it's it has a lot of contrast and there's a red car for example and you want to isolate this uh, or change the color of the red car or make some effects on it so you can sometimes it's uh, it's working that you can isolate that car with this feature so uh, with a rotoscoping you spend a lot of time and sometimes uh, this can be very helpful so I click OK and it's automatically um, put on a white solid this mask so now I'm, I'm doing the same I'm, I'm bringing this uh, over the texture and um, doing the, uh, the same so but now uh, we have uh, the masks and with the masks uh, we have the opportunity to uh, yeah to change uh, the behavior and the style so we can feather this out or uh, in, in one direction So, or you can increase and of course everything together so you get a little bit uh, cell style so and of course you can animate um, mask uh, click uh, on the stopwatch so if you select the uh, the mask f for every letter there's a mask and now you can uh, animate the mask so this is just an example I don't know for for what's good now <laughs> in this particular case I don't know but think about this is not a rusty texture um, it's blood or, or something like this and uh, so you see it's it's a nice effect of course if you're making gore movies uh, I like gore movies uh, so the text coming out of the blood uh, so this is um, this is a feature uh, I will do this for for these two and uh, skip it so now I prepared this uh, so look it's a nice effect so 
yeah so you can do a lot of nice things with that so I uh, just make it for fun now and uh, switch it to screen so we have these are you so are you uh, copy this layer string D duplicate and make the same as uh, as here to the uh, alpha mati and screen screen it the red layer now you have this nice effect so now you can select them all and go to layers and then make a new composition it's a it's a very good thing because w uh, w when we uh, put another layer on it and then some effects on this text layer so everything will uh, be affected on that layer so I make a new composition I call it bloody text and now I can uh, put again these the original oops rusty uh, texture on it to look to the size uh, 34 so uh, now we can uh, make an effect on this like the um, perspective menu the alpha card now we have it a little bit Edgar Wallace or something like this I don't know so make a preview so some uh, really nice cool effect and when you use plugins uh, which are using a uh, mask and there are some inside of After Effects and some uh, from uh, third parties like um, Trap Code uh, Stroke you can have uh, another really nice uh, effects um, so I switch this off and get the uh, trap code uh, 3d stroke um, yeah I have to say a big thank you to uh, to trap code because they make really good good uh, plugins they are not uh, cost ex uh, expensive and and they are really great great stuff so if you have a camera or you don't need a really camera for that but you can use it you have this text and the stroke plugin and now you can uh, play with the thickness of the mask or you can feather this out and you can just you see this nice thing and you can uh, transform it you can bend it in the in the, in the space so um to use the com camera and and now you see the text is uh, in the space so uh, really cool features uh, you can repeat this and animate this like other stuff uh, you can uh, fade this out and all the things uh, it's uh, really nice nice stuff there so you see and of course you can animate it I hope you enjoyed it and get be inspired <laughs>